Hey everyone, it's Megan with The Crafty Planner Lover here, and welcome back to my channel, or welcome if you are new. In today's video, I am going to be unboxing a package that I got from Growing Modestly, and I'm going to show you tons of different stickers that are available in her shop right now, and I am excited to show you this. guys are not already aware, Emily, who is the owner of Growing Modestly Sticker and Accessory Shop, I am an affiliate for Growing Modestly, so if you choose to use my 20% off code, which is Megan20, then it will save you 20% off of your order, but it will give me a small commission. I would love it if you guys would use my code because it is at no cost to you, but it does help me out a lot, and it helps me share more amazing products, just like the ones I'm about to show you and it helps me support Emily, which is the most uh, important thing in my opinion. Enough rambling, we are gonna go ahead and open up this package. Now I just wanna let you guys know I did purchase these on my own. These are not um, things that I have been sent from Emily. I will always let you know if it is an affiliate package or if it is things that I purchased with my own money. So this entire package, purchased with my own money, I am very excited to use this. <laughs> All right, so she always sends her stuff in little mailers or little bubble packages just so that the, you know, shipping doesn't mess everything up. Because sometimes they bend, sometimes they, you know, squish things. So she always tries to make sure that they are packaged perfectly for you. Alrighty, so we've got some $1 Friday items, some winter and... Um, summer items, lots of different things. So I'm going to take everything out of the package and then get to all of the goodies inside. So she always sends little things to you, uh, like little freebies and little gifts, um, like little journaling cards with your order. So this is something that she always sends, a thank you card, and then a description of um, what you can do to save off of your order. And she also says, tag me in your posts on Instagram when you use my stickers in your planner. I would love to see what you create. She always loves to see that. So definitely tag her if you are not already doing that. And then she also sent something um, for her $1 Fridays. They are available the first Friday of each month at 10 a.m. all the way through that Monday at 11.59. She will have new designs on her shop each month, but the previous designs will also be there. So here is one of the journaling cards that you can get. Now they are randomly picked, but she does, um, you know, change them out seasonally. So this is one of the beautiful ones that I received. And then of course we've got some freebies. So we've got the spring freebie, a Black Friday freebie, and then the 2024 freebie. So very, very pretty. Love these, cannot wait to use them kind of thinking of doing these first and then all of this. That's what we're gonna start with. We're gonna start with our papers and the oops bags. All right, so I got some scrapbook papers and vellums. So the first one is this one, which is the vintage newspaper scrapbook paper. Then we have glistening water scrapbook, or uh, sorry, not glistening water scrapbook paper, glistening water vellum. Then we have the Mittens, Cozy Mittens Vellum. And then another vellum, which is the Tropical Florals. So lots of beautiful papers, so excited for these. Now I got the scrapbook paper because I have some of her other vintage scrapbook papers and I wanted to get this one because I had missed out and I wanted to grab that. And then for the vellums, um, this one was part of the like, uh, what is it? Not sale, but um, it was part of the, yeah, it was part of the winter sale. So I was like, oh my gosh, I gotta get this because it's so pretty and I love it. Obviously, it's not winter time anymore, um, at the time of me filming at least, um, but I thought this would be cute to get for next winter. And then, because summertime is coming up, I wanted to get these water, uh, water, wow, the water vellum and the florals because I'm going to put them, I don't know if I'm going to use them in my Hobonichi Cousin, or my B6 planner, or my social media planner, but I'm going to use them in a planner. So I wanted to get all of them unpunched. Now you can get them punched to different sizes, um, and she has them all listed whenever you choose your scrapbook paper. If you want to get them unpunched, you totally can. I like to get them unpunched because um, 
I don't have a happy planner right now in my lineup and I also want to be able to manipulate the papers exactly how I want. And I forgot to mention her scrapbook papers are double sided. Um, so keep that in mind if you are wanting to get um, scrapbook paper, they are double sided. Now her vellums are not necessarily double sided. Um, as you can see, these are kind of like clear vellum backing papers, but I do like I like them anyway. I'm like, they're, it's vellum, so you can see what it is in the background. So just keep that in mind um, when you are ordering. Um, now, you cannot get scrapbook papers and vellums printables um, or $1 Friday items, but she does have printables on her shop. She's going through them all to put them together to make them printables. Um, so if you want to get physical stickers, you can. Just know that scrapbook papers, vellums, and $1 Fridays are not available in printable form. So I got a regular random oops bag and a seasonal oops bag. So let's do the seasonal one first because I like seasons. Now keep in mind that oops bags can be anything from like off cut items to like the cut was too close to the sticker or it could be, you know, uh, the coloring isn't proper but I have never really had any issues with oops items and I think that it is a great way for you to try out a shop if you are not necessarily aware of how a sticker is cut. I love oops bags. They're amazing and they're always super fun. So here we go. This is fall leaves. So as you can see, like I said with oops, sometimes they are like a little blurry or um, sometimes the cut is off. So this one is beautiful. Love it. Oh my gosh, peonies. Uh, okay, so here, here's an example of an oops. So I actually have the peonies collection. Now this is from her spring 2024 collection. And in the actual sheet, the um, you can see it a little bit here. The calligraphy, like the lines above the calligraphy are not as vibrant as they are in the actual like a sticker set. So that's why this is an oops. But honestly, I don't even care. I'm obsessed. Love them always. Emily has amazing stickers, so they're never oops for me. They're always 100% great. Okay, then we have New Year's cakes. And again, like I said, you can tell sometimes if it's an oops just by looking at it, but most of the time you can't. Like this one, don't see any issues on it. Same with fall leaves. Then we have Woodsy Winter, and this one looks like some of the cuts are a little bit less intense. So some of them haven't been cut, like the uh, the Cricut or whatever kind of like cutter she uses uh, didn't go through all the way. Um, so that's why it's an oops. But y'all, I don't care. You know me. I will cut stickers out if I want to. I have no complaints. Love them. Emily's amazing. Amazing. Okay, then we have a uh, Chic Fall. I love this collection and this is pretty. I am excited to use this for this fall. Then we've got Fall Decorative Circles. Again, with this one, you can see that the cut lines are not completely in. I am only telling you guys this so that you get full transparency on when you get an oops sticker. That's that's literally the reason why I like to let you know. For this one, as you can see, some of the um cut lines haven't been completely in and there was a little accidental rip here um and then we have autumn florals again it looks like the cut line was not all the way through on this one but as you can see you get different sizes you get different styles you get different kinds of things for your oops bags and y'all these are amazing oh my gosh and you can see like the different kinds of stickers that she used to have in her shop and like what was once in her shop and now is like retired or she just like doesn't have enough to stock on the actual website that's what this is so sometimes it's just like extra by extra words extra items then we have fall leaves again it looks like this one the cut lines aren't completely through and again you guys know i don't care and then we have boho pumpkins oh great great oops bag i'm excited to use these and y'all oh this is going to be so therapeutic for me to just sit there and like fix the cuts for myself because that's something that i actually do like to do so love this excited okay next is another oops bag this is a random oops bag i forgot to see how many come in this so there are 10 uh oops items in the bags by the way just so you're aware and i believe that's the same with the random sheets as well okay so this is the random oops bags so we've got ooh, oh, these are pretty 
pastel purple hexagons. And I think the only reason why this is an oops is because the logo is a little off center. But I honestly don't even care. Oh my gosh. See, these don't even look like oops to me. These are beautiful. Emily, you're so sweet. Sending me all these kinds of, oh my gosh. Oh, boxes. Um, obviously this is random, so it's not like she purposefully put these in here, but I'm obsessed. She knows how much I like to use boxes in my spreads with like when they're a specific shop. So, oh my gosh, I am so excited about these boxes. Ooh, Paris washi. Okay, then we have gratitude and this one isn't completely cut out. Um, like the uh, cut lines aren't fully in, but it's okay because I will just cut them out by hand. Don't care. Gratitude quotes is amazing. And then we have more monthly headers and these are in clear. And that's exciting because I need some monthly headers. So I am excited about these oops bags, you guys. These are great. I love oops bags. They're great, great ways to try out shops. Like as you can see, there's really no issue with the oops bags. There's really not. Now we're moving on to the other items in my order. I'm going to move all of these out of the way. Okay, so we have this beautiful little bookmark. This is a, um, like a leopard print with this beautiful little uh, tassel and a little heart chain at the top. Very cute. I am excited to use this. This is going to encourage me to read more because I have not been reading. I need to read and now I have a bookmark to actually encourage me to read. So that's what this is for. Okay, then we have some die cuts here. So we have the I Love Coffee die cut. I'm going to move this. Very cute. A Maker's Gonna Make die cut and these are like shiny. And then we have these two, which are, or sorry, these four, which are not shiny. Oh, Emily, you're so sweet. Did that, that's not what that came with, right? Oh my gosh. Okay, so I got the Tropical Dolphin die cut, but she included one that has my name in it. I don't know if that's part of the listing, but I'm pretty sure it's not. Emily, you are so sweet. Oh, you're gonna make me cry. Okay, and then we have the Your Path die cut, and it says, not all storms come to disrupt your life. Some come to clear your path. So pretty. Love this one. Then we have Latte Love. This is a little uh, coffee cup, and I'm obsessed with it. And I also, you know, coffee goes together. And then this one is called Citrus, and this is just a little die cut that... I thought would be cute for the summertime. I forgot to mention that this die cut is called Coffee Enthusiast. Now we're moving on to the $1 Friday items and the package. Getting a sneak peek at the rest of them. So we've got some doctor icons. I got two of these um, just because I, I need, I'm, I... <sighs> let me tell you something, you guys. I got these during when, like literally right before I was going to have my surgery, right? Because I was like, oh my gosh, I'm gonna have so many doctor's appointments coming up. Turns out I actually am having a lot of doctor's appointments now because of my surgery. So um, now these are going to be very, very helpful. <laughs> um, then we have Record, and I think I got two of these. Yes, two. So needed those. Then we've got the Record Icons. I only got one of these because I, I, I don't need don't need more than one right now. Because I think I actually have some. Then we have the puppy dogs, which are so cute. Look at them. It's going to be perfect for me to track whenever I am walking Bruce or whenever I am, um, you know, if it's my turn to feed him or whatever. Very, very excited about these. Um, and as you <laughs> will hear in the next clip, Bruce decided that he wanted to come in and say hi, but he is a sneaky little ninja and did not tell me that uh he was coming in like he did not make any noises so he scared me so you're welcome anyways now we're gonna get into not that this wasn't my actual order but we're gonna get into the items oh my god oh, Bruce. Oh, oh. so i hope you guys enjoyed that cute little thing okay then we have monday or sorry daily headers i got five of those because 
I'm running out and I'm probably going to get more, but we've got, we've got these. So lots of daily headers. Okay. So that's everything with my $1 Friday's purchase. Now we're getting into the sticker goodies. Okay. So I got the mushrooms, uh, the toadstool, AKA mushrooms from her fall release. So I got the small and the large sheet. So this is the small version. Then I got the, um, my God quotes here. So I thought this would be really good to use in my uh, planner. Then we've got lots of boxes. So this is the Summer Tones three and four bundle boxes. So you've got, this is uh, obviously number three is this size box and number four is this size box. So I got these because I wanted to have um, some for the summertime, springtime, but also, like I said, you guys know that I am a huge advocate for using all of the items from one specific shop. So I like to use boxes, dates, covers, uh, stickers, um, from one shop. So I got these in the three and four because I thought these would be the most used boxes that I have, or the boxes that I use the most. So we've got Monstera Green. We've got Ocean Blue. Again, these are three and four. Seashell Pink, three and four. I feel like I'm missing. There we go. Okay, sorry. Tropical Blue. These are beautiful. <gasps> Such a pretty color. Okay. Then we have Sun Orange in three and four. Summer Red in three and four. And then Sandy Tan in three and four. So these are all of the colors that you can get in the uh, Summer Tones boxes. And like I said, box number four looks like this if you get them in the bundle of the number four. And then if you get the number three bundle, they all look like this. So very excited to have boxes. Okay, and then you guys already saw what the fall leaves looks like, um, but this is what they look like without them being, oops, so I can grab the fall leaves so you can see the difference. Now remember that one of them is matte and the other is clear, so this is what they look like. It doesn't honestly look any different. They all look the same, and this is how her matte sheets uh, versus clear sheets look anyway, so um, this is, not, now I have an extra, yay! <laughs> Then Tropical Elements. Now I have actually used this uh, before in her summer release of last year. So I've actually used this kind of uh, boxes before, but I wanted to get them again because I love them so much and I am excited because I'm going on a cruise soon. So I thought this would be perfect for that. Then we have summer quotes. Again, needed some summer quotes for the summertime. So very excited about these. It says life is cool by the pool, summer days, or sorry, sunny days ahead. First day of summer, summer, beach life kind of days, sunshine on my mind, on summer vacation mode. Soak up the sun. If it's not air conditioned, I ain't going, ugh, preach. I need vitamin C, summer, 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 time to put my sunglasses on, lay on my pool float, sip on some lemonade, and just drift away into summer life. Life. That sounds relaxing, but not for Florida. <laughs> but I love these quotes. Then Father's Day is coming up. So of course I had to get the Dad and Me sticker sheet because I thought this was very, very cute. And, you know, Father's Day. Love the things. I already have the Mother's Day sticker set, so don't need that one. But I needed to get the Father's Day one. And this color matches pretty closely with the Dad and Me sheet. So see? Double use. Okay, then we have the coral um, sticker, what are these called, uh, deco pieces. Love these so much, and they're going to be so fun to use, and I can actually probably combine them with tropical elements, as well as waves, which I also got, and this is in the clear sheet. So, you know, I can make a whole spread just out of these three. Um, then I got watercolor woodland animals, and I got them in matte and clear, just for funsies. Actually, did I get them in matte and clear? Okay, I did not get them in clear, so this was an extra one. Oh, thank you, Emily, you're so sweet. Um, so I did get them in matte, um, but she included a clear one, and that's really exciting. Now I have two of them. <gasps> look at how cute they are. Oh my gosh, okay, so first of all, look at this squirrel. 
Look how cute he is. He's just so cute. Oh, I love this. This is going to be great. I don't know if I'm going to use this for spring or for fall, but I have them now and I'm very excited. We have fall tone leopard print in both clear and matte. So I wanted to get them in both because I didn't know which one I wanted to use. And again, this is going to be perfect for the um, either fall time or for the summer because I think of like jungle when I think of summertime sometimes. And you know, these guys would probably go really well with this. Hmm. The gears are turning. Anyway, that's this one. Okay, then we have two different kinds of stickers. So we have Mon... Monstera? Mon... Mm -hmm. Monstera? Monstera in clear and matte. Oh, look at how pigmented this is. Oh, it's so pretty. Um, and then I also got the Monstera clusters in it matte. So I thought that these would be so cute for, you know, the summertime. And also, these kind of match. The gears are turning, you guys. Then I also got the Sea Turtles stickers in clear and matte. So this is what they look like in matte. This is what they look like in clear matte, y'all. Look at how pigmented these are. Oh, they're so pretty. Oh, oh, you know what? Look at how cool that would look together. Oh my gosh. Okay, y'all, I'm already seeing ideas here. This is, I am getting way too excited. I'm sorry. This is what happens when I have coffee right before I film a video. Okay, then we have Buzzin' in the Hive. This is a deco sheet, and I thought this was perfect for spring, so I'm so excited. I'm going to be using this very, very soon. Okay, wood slices. Now, I have gotten this before. Um, I have, you know, this has been a sticker set that I have gotten previously, and I loved it so much that I needed to get it again. I loved the spread I had created, um, and I will link it on the screen so you guys can watch it if you want to, and I will also link the Tropical Elements video that I did with, I think I did a social media spread with this one, and I know I did a currently with this one, so you guys can check those out if you want to, but again, I loved it so much that I needed to get it again. Then we have Whales, and this is in matte. Again, I am seeing some ideas form here, you guys, like, those are like perfect together, aren't they? I think this is just adorable. Okay, sorry. Then we have the library. Now, this one was something that was released back in her fall release, and I really, really, really wanted to get it, but I didn't think to do it. So now I have this, and if you guys haven't seen my um, book themed loop group video, uh, Emily, who is in the loop group, I, she didn't use these stickers. She said she might use her library stickers, but this is the sticker sheet she was talking about when she said she might use her library stickers, but I had actually originally thought of using these, but then I was like, ah, oh, crap, I don't have them, and then I placed the order. <laughs> and I was like, well, now I do. So now I'm going to make a library spread uh, of books to purchase and things. So yes. Okay, then we have Lemon Florals. This is so pretty. I love this sticker sheet. I got it in clear and matte because I'm a child. I'm thinking I might use this in a spread very, very soon because I feel like this is definitely like summer and spring. It's kind of like a combo, so love these. Again, I got Here Comes the Sun in clear and matte. I don't know. I just thought, you know, you never know if you need to use clear or matte. So very excited. Oh, I did. Okay. I got two toadstools in the mini and then one in the big. And again, that's because I have a specific idea of what I'm going to do with these guys. Uh, I think I haven't made the spread yet or thought about my spread idea, so I'm not 100% sure, but I have them just in case. Then this was part of her fall release, and I wanted to get this again because I have some leftover stickers from that, and I want to make another spread with them in October because... I really loved the spread I had created, um, so I got this sheet again. Then I got some vintage journaling pieces because I had done a spread with these in my health and wellness planner back last year. Again, I'll link that video. Um, and I loved the vintage journaling pieces, so I thought they would be really pretty to use again. So I got my two favorites, number two and number three. This one's probably my favorite because of the colors and just the designs. So pretty, so I had to get it again. And I'm pretty sure I actually already have vintage newspaper 
pieces. These are like the journaling pieces, kind of like this one, but different. Actually, I think it, no, it's different. Um, anyway, sorry, tangent. Um, but I wanted to get this specifically because um, I really loved the, I love her journaling pieces, but I also thought when I was getting the library one that this might be a good thing. <laughs> Okay, then we have a couple of sticker kits. So we have Pompa's Grass. So I got all four sheets, and then I also got some extras. So I got another set of washi and another set of deco. So the kit itself, the all four sheets, comes with the boxes, the functional boxes, deco and washi and then to go along with it I got another set of the deco and washi just in case with the washi I got it because I knew I would need it um and then with the deco I just was like you never know you can never have enough so this might be a fall kit for me or it might be a spring kit but I'm thinking it's going to be spring I mean I have enough I could probably use it for both but um I loved this kit and I had to get it Okay, then another kit we have is Winter Florals. And I just got the full sticker sheet. So this is what this, oh, by the way, this one is from her recent 2023 winter release, just so you know. Um, and this is the functional boxes. You've got deco here and then two sets of washi. So that's the reason why I only chose to get it in one instead of adding extras just because I knew that this washi would be enough and I knew that these florals would be enough because I actually have other florals that go really really well with this um, that are from Growing Modestly. I may have hauled them last haul, I don't remember, but I have some that will go with this so that's why I only chose to get the entire kit. Okay and then we have this kit which is called Tropical Summer Vibes and again I only got the four sheets for this one mainly because I have more boxes just in case I need them. So we've got the regular boxes and then we have the boxes with functional stuff. Then we have the deco and I actually have a sticker that looks just like this that I will be using. And then we have the washi so lots of beautiful items here and I'm thinking I might use this in my social media planner for the first day of summer, but I'm not sure. It's a very cute kit though, like love it. Cannot wait for her summer release. I don't know what is going to be in her summer release, but I'm excited about it. It's going to be fun. All right, everyone, that is it for this haul from Growing Modestly. It's a long haul, long video. I'm so sorry, but I love supporting Emily. I love her stickers and I am just absolutely obsessed with everything she has. If you are wanting to save money, once again, you can use my code MEGAN20 and save yourself 20% off. However, I will leave her regular link in the description box. It is not affiliate. It's just her website. It's www.growingmodestly.com. It will be in the description box. So if you feel like you have another code that you want to use, um, but I am so excited about using all of these stickers. If you guys are wanting to see how I use them, don't forget to hit that notification bell so you are notified when I post new videos. And also subscribe because that way you will see when I do different videos with Growing Modestly. Once again, I want to thank you for watching this video. I want to thank Emily from Growing Modestly for sending me little extra pieces here and there in this uh, beautiful haul. I, you definitely did not have to do that, but I really appreciate that you did. Um, and I am so excited to support you. I'm so excited to share more of your releases coming very soon. And I am so excited for you guys to see all of the great things coming to Growing Modestly very, very soon. Once again, thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. I truly hope this was a good video for you to watch. I hope you enjoyed it. And until next time, craft on. Bye guys.